just so glad to connect again with kids. Um, I know our teachers uh, and our um, administrators, our principals at the campus level are enjoying getting to see their kids again and connect a little bit, even though that's dropping into your household. So we're so glad you're here. There's a lot of great things going on. Um, device deployment happening this week at the elementary level um, for all of those families who need an extra device in their house to make sure that the elementary students are able to connect with the learning that we're offering. Um, I had the good fortune of chatting with a, a high school student today from Rouse High School um, and just getting a little bit of feedback about what their experience is like. Um, and that was great to hear a little bit about how things are going from the student's perspective. And we're gonna do quite a bit more of that as we go forward so that we can make sure that we're meeting individual needs. As you know, we've been making a big push for using this change as an opportunity to do something amazing. And so we continue to urge you to take a lot of time with your families to build those relationships to take the time that you just normally wouldn't have had in the spring. The spring is usually such a crazy time and very busy for students and for families. And, and this has given us a little pause to say, what are the most important things to us and how do we manage those things in our life? We hope that all of you are well and healthy. We hope that you continue to be well and healthy and stay safe over this time. We urge you to follow the CDC regulations to stay home to listen to the advice that's coming out. Um, the more we do that, the less it will feel like we're in a crisis, but the better it will be for all of us. So with that, I'm gonna turn you back to Corey.